Hello human, thank you for being on the channel. I want you to click the subscribe button to join the Terrence family. What you have here is an adaption of the classic Hanna-Barbera property, which reveals how Tom and Jerry first meet and form their rivalry. Uh, Tom, the cat, he gets fucked over a lot. Shit don't be working out for Tom. Jerry, on the other hand, the mouse, that's a lucky motherfucker right there. Things just be working in his favor. And Jerry ends up going to this fancy-ass hotel. It's one of those fancy-ass hotels when you see it from the outside, you're like, yeah, that's pretty nice. And then you go in and you're like, yeah, this is going to cost a pretty penny right here. Which enters the Chloe Grace Moretz character, uh, Kayla. And Kayla, she is just an opportunistic asshole. Like, she steals the credentials of this one female so that way she can work in this fancy-ass hotel. I'm not saying Kayla's evil, but goddamn. You know, she just, you could tell she been working that game for a while. Like, she knows how to do what she needs to do to come up in the world. You know, I guess on one end, I could kind of respect something like that. You have some kind of wedding that goes on at this fancy-ass hotel. And um, here's the thing. Jerry's in this hotel. He's a fucking mouse, and, you know, humans don't like that shit. So, um, Kayla has to figure out how to deal with Jerry. So... Kayla sets up a couple of traps, hoping that Jerry would be dumb enough to get, you know, caught in one of these traps, so that way Jerry can get taken out of the equation, and Jerry sees these traps, right, he just like, he smells like the cheese and the various food, he's just like, hell yeah, that shit smell good as fuck, and he sees a trap, like, what kind of shit is this, you expect me to fall for this, damn human, and then Kayla realizes, like, okay, you know, Jerry's smart as fuck, so, um, now Tom is outside, right? This motherfucker outside in the rain and shit, you know, maybe he got a cracker to eat or something, and Jerry just living it up, taking showers and shit, eating the best kind of food. Tom is like, this is some bullshit. I need to find a way to get inside this fancy-ass hotel. So you have the Kayla character and Tom, they work together. They're like, they're like, look, 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 let's figure out what we need to do. And Kayla's like, look, Tom, um, you know, you, you a fucking cat, right? You know, it's basically in your DNA to deal with someone like Jerry, who's a mouse, you know, I need you to wreck that motherfucker, I need you to kill him and get him out this hotel, and Tom is just like, hey, you know, I, I don't even like that nigga Jerry, like, fuck him, you know, I'm about to wreck his shit, you know, then maybe I could be able to sleep in uh, room 102 or something like that, and it's just interesting, so that's pretty much how uh, Tom gets into this fancy-ass hotel, and you know how humans are with their weddings and shit. Humans love relationships. They love getting married, even though the uh, the divorce rates are high. So you got that kind of shit going on. And um, I just thought it was interesting seeing Tom out in the rain. I'm just like, hey, man. Hey, hey Tom, I, I, bet, I get it, man. I've been out there in the rain, too. Motherfuckers living it up and shit. You just out on the streets. I get it. But Tom and Jerry, like, when they get together, they just be trying to kill each other all the time. And Tom tries to kill Jerry all the time, and that shit don't be working. Like, Tom be having the craziest fucking weapons to kill Jerry with, and that shit don't work. Jerry's like, ha, <laughs> you missed me, motherfucker. Ha, <laughs> try it again. <laughs> Miss me again. <laughs> try it again. Like, it's just funny. And then, like, you know, Tom, you, Tom be getting irritated. He's like, you know what, Jerry, I'm going to kill your ass if it's the last thing I do. And then Jerry just got that look on his face. Good luck. <laughs> Good luck, Tom, because... You've been trying for a long ass time, and as you can see, I'm still alive. On a scale from 1 to 10, 1 being horseshit on a hot, smelly ass day, and 10 being mind blowingly amazing, I'm gonna give this movie a 6 out of 10. Eh, it's alright. You know what I mean? I don't ever need to see it again. You know, I remember when I was a kid, I watched Tom and Jerry. I'm not like a huge fan of them, but this is kind of like the, the cartoon and shit, but the cartoon is better. But this is an interesting attempt. Really, I only watched this movie because of Chloe Grace Moretz. You know, I think she's a cool actress, and I don't really see her in a whole lot of stuff. So I was like, hey, I know Chloe. You know, she cool. You know, I watch it because of her, and I'm like, I know Tom and Jerry, so let me see what's up with this. And um, in this film, you will get to see how the whole Tom and Jerry rivalry starts and stuff like that. And you got this corny love shit in there because of the whole humans trying to get married at this fancy-ass hotel. Um... So, Chloe is cool, uh, Michael Pena is cool, Ken Jeong is cool, but uh, to me, the movie just, alright, you know, this this shit is clearly meant for kids, you know what I'm saying, like, this, I feel like the kid's gonna enjoy it 
more than the adults, but there might be some adults out there that dig this, um, some adults that are really big into Tom and Jerry, but me, I'm just like, eh, you know, I saw it, it's alright, I ain't gotta see this shit again. Thank you for being here, human. I want you to like this video, share it with your family, your friends, whatever humans you may know. Punch the shit out of the subscribe button to join the Terrence family. Terrence out.